What's good, Space Cowboys? Zero here. I am back to show you a couple new ships I've got here. This first video here, I just want to show you one that I picked up from the Mantis quest line. It is called the Razor Leaf. Uh, beautiful ship. Very quick, very quick. Nimble. Uh, got some nice blasters on it. One blaster, I'm not quite sure exactly uh, what it does. I think maybe disable ships. I haven't played around with this one too much, but uh, you know we'll kind of see later on. If you have an idea, you know, let me know. Uh, it is very cool ship. We'll take a look around the outside, uh, and the inside is not too spacious. It's actually very similar to the starter ship, uh, although it has a really nice um sort of weapon and armor display room that your uh starter frontier does not have uh this is a legendary ship uh the only way to obtain it is through the quest um if you haven't picked up that quest go do it um it is a lot of fun uh great lore uh you also pick up this awesome set of armor helmet and boost pack as well um you know, I mean, it's a typical Class A ship here. You know, your lasers are decent. Uh, it has these disruptor beams as well. Um, does have missiles, which is fine. Uh, the engines are really where this thing shines. I mean, it is it is fast. It is a dart. So we'll get outside, take a look at this. Let's set this to our home ship here. Um, we might pick up a little bounty and see if we can do a little bit of combat just to see how it handles against a few ships here. Like I said, it looks pretty similar to your starter ship. Uh, color palette's a little different. Maybe more, I don't know, army drab green colors here. More mantis-like, I guess. I love the name, the Razor Leaf. What a great, great name for that one. Nice vertical takeoff engines here. So instead of like the rotating engines that the Frontier has, uh, it does have one set of vertical uh, set engines here, but it has just sort of these down facing engines on those blocks. Not a lot of cargo on this thing. You can see there's your cargo compartment right there. It does have a pretty decent range. So I'll show you the. Armor and weapons display room is right up here. So as soon as you come in, you head right up these stairs, and you have this little loft area. Really cool. Uh, I mean, this is only the third ship I've actually obtained, so I didn't uh, haven't really seen any other ships that have anything like this. But you do have some. Uh, decent storage if you want to store some weapons, uh, store a helmet, if you need to store any items. Uh, you also have some great weapons racks here. You got a booster pack stand, you have an armor stand here. Oh, I'm sorry, that's another backpack stand. Lots of weapon racks, lots of booster pack stands. I thought there was a mannequin in here, but I guess I could have been mistaken about that. This is a nice nice little touch um, you know I am not to the point yet where I have like a lot of things I really want to start displaying uh, this is also um, not quite the type of ship I have the skills to fly yet I mean I can fly it but I don't have the shields or the laser skills to really make this ship shine the way it should um, not much to the berth here um, I mean, you've got a little bed, uh, desk, and then that's it. You get up here, you've got a couple jump seats for your crew, your storage as usual by the pilot seat, and then we're going to take off. See what that ascending cutscene looks like. You know what I forgot to do here? And we're going to exit really quick. Let's go pick up a bounty. Uh, that way we can... Actually, do I have a bounty already? I do have a bounty. Let's go do this bounty. Greetings, Captain. Let's go ahead and take off out to space. See what this beauty looks we like from the outside. 
outside. I like those sort of wing, wing engines Eight out there. Point reached. Orbit stable. jump here for Delta Pavonis and see if we can't get a fight going. Show you how this puppy acts in real action. Doesn't carry very many crew. It is only a two-seater. Although, the cargo hold on this is super small, so uh, I'm not even going to ask for payment. That's really impressive. Yeah, I know. We got to resume our patrol. Stay safe. Let me take a bow. So, that is the Razor Leaf, guys. That is one of my newest ships. Probably won't be flying it much till I skill up some of my ship skills a little bit more uh, but quite a beautiful ship if you find better modules for this I would definitely start upgrading it I know that was one of the things that was kind of recommended in the lore as you go through the mantis uh, layer and saying the ship is solid it's got a great body and frame but some of the parts are a bit older so you might want to find a bit of upgrades for the weapons, shields, etc. Anything that you can fit on it at the time. <laughs> you can see it's super small cargo. I'm way overloaded. Uh, but that is the Mantis. I'm sorry, the Razor Leaf that you get from the Mantis Quest. Hope you guys go get that yourself. If you're wondering how to do that, go check out my video on the Mantis Quest. Till then, fly safe. I'll check you later. Cheers.